Welcome to this uh, shortwave radio channel and I uh, just want to explain what it does for those that were wondering because somebody of course a lot of you were saying hey uh, you know you have you calibrated your C crane receiver as per the manual and um, it's important and so on um, just want to mention what it actually does because a lot of you that have this radio just don't understand exactly what it does it's not um, you know, explained in detail, but from what I understand it is, is that it simply retunes the circuitry to make sure that you're uh, tuning the stations with the most precise tuning possible. Now, how does it know that? Well, the procedure that it does, so we're going to do it here live. What you do is you hold the clock button when the radio is on for six seconds until you hear a beep and you see the red light at the top left. Once you do that, a quick press of clock. Now you see the blinking light at the top left and you'll see that the radio will actually uh, display the frequency every um, 100 kilohertz in, uh, the, uh, on the screen. So what it does is it actually will search for all the stations on the bands and what I believe it does is it simply kind of finds the center point of all the signals and because most AM radio stations are in general pretty precise on their frequency it probably uses that as a reference so it will try to peak the strongest signal possible in order to uh, simply tune in to whatever station so it kind of goes through uh, a tuning phase one of the uh, uh, interesting aspects of this radio is it uh, seems to have i i i need to to research more but it almost looks like it has some dsp stage in it because and the way that it actually fine tunes and then the way that it actually try to find a signal and sometimes when you tune around a medium wave band it feels like a DSB stage is tuning um, because I kind of have the same feel and same way of listening to uh, a signal. So this actually uh, seems interesting for that. So you see it go through all the stages, it's gonna go all the way down to 520 kilohertz. And once it has done this phase up to 520 kilohertz, what you need to do is to use a paper clip or a little pointy object and reset the receiver from the reset button that is just at the bottom under the radio. So um, basically it's a calibration by using all the signals that it receives and it tries to just make sure that you're always on the frequency when you tune in uh, to the different stations. They say that this would be uh, useful f in two situations if you have a radio that is in a new location so for example mine is brand new so it's a good idea to do it and also it is a good idea uh, to do it once a year according to the manual so it simply keeps the radio tuned as precisely as possible to the frequency range that you're listening to so once it's complete pointed object at the bottom, you reset the radio. Keep in mind that you'll have to reset the clock and you'll have to, if you had any presets, they're all gone. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.